Today, I just want to emphasize a very simple concept that most people, even many professionals, don't quite appreciate, even though we actually all know about this pretty well, which is because of the asymmetry of returns. Losing money is a lot easier than making money. Just look at a simple example. Starting with $100, if you make 10% on day one, you now have $110. But now you lose 10% on day two. Now 10% of $110 is $11. So you end up with $99, $1 less than when you started. Even though you make and lose 10%, the same percentage on those two days. Now you say, okay, I'm going to change my strategy. When my model says go long, I go short, and when it says go short, I go long. Since I lost money with the old model, this new strategy, the opposite of the old strategy, must be making money. Back to the simple example earlier, that means you lose 10% on day one, you now have $90. Then you make 10% back on day two, but unfortunately now it's only 10% of $90, which is $9. So again, you end up with $99. Losing money is really easier than making money. To take a further look, let's create a strategy that makes 5% half the time, and the other half loses 5%. You can see even though all the percentage returns cancel out to zero, you are actually losing money consistently. Now you take the opposite signal of the strategy, and you see even though on a daily basis, your profit and loss switch directions. Overall, you are still losing money consistently. After a year, both lost about 30%. So, because of this asymmetry of percentage or logarithmic returns, losing money is a lot easier than making money. And in order to make money, you need a strategy with reward to risk ratio quite a bit larger than one. Or a strategy making money a lot more often than losing money. Okay, thanks for checking out this video. Hope this is helpful and hope to see you next time.